Hey, it's John V3 IPS here. We're at Scares, Simcoe County Amateur Radio Club. They have a really awesome ham fest that they put on all the time. And uh, starting to get the crowd starting to come in here and starting to fill stuff up. So we got Mario the Tube Man. Uh, everything you want to know with tubes, he's got them. If you don't see it, he'll get the tube for you. He's, uh, he's the tube man. Got Mike M MKX, Mr. QRP. He's always got great stuff on his table for the low power guys. Always lots of good stuff. We'll see Mike down at uh, Dayton. And then uh, we got another table here. Lots of good stuff. We got a scope, all kinds of antennas and stuff like that. So if you're an antenna guy, look at that. He's got all the antennas here, scanners. It's even got looks like a zoom spot, so it's not fooling around. And you don't see these too often, these SWR meters. That's KW Electronics. And I, I already bought my audio cables untested, and one cable's already bad, but uh, I'll just cut the end off and put a new connector on it, right? More stuff here, V3DX, he's got the call sign everybody wants, and he's selling his original ICOM 02AT. Where do you buy that? Atlantic Ham, VE Amateur Sales, Radio World? Or Many Norham, years then? ago. Many years ago. Awesome. How are you doing, John? Doing pretty good. How are you, man? I heard some great traffic coming uh, on 20 meters late at night from 4X4 from Israel. I, I couldn't believe it. The guy, the guy had a pileup. I uh, had a contact with one, one of my friends in Holy Land Contest. Oh, wow. <laughs> and here we go. We've got here uh, a test set here, FM signal generator. More CB stuff here with Jason, PLJ, books and stuff. <laughs> here, we got a loop antenna here. What's going on? We got a loop antenna here. And uh, let's walk around behind this guy's table, see what he's got. Oh look, an FD-818ND, 14283. Just listening into the signals here. We got Dennis here. Uh, he's, uh, he's got a lot of two-way radio gear here. He's a repeater expert. More stuff here on tubes. This guy's competing with Mario the Tube Man, inadvertently. He didn't expect Mario to show up, but he's here. How you doing, man? Kevin with the 3640 net. You got nothing to do? Check into his net. He's looking for check-ins. Yeah, he never gets more radio stuff. Yeah, he never has anything to say on the net. He's too busy doing the check-ins there with the net logger. He's got so many contacts. Free magazines here. Look at all this stuff here. They're free and they're still on the table. So we'll see what happens. More people will come and take it away. More odds and ends radio stuff. Look here. Boost your HT or FT817. Even a 432 transverter. Wow. Medium power built in amplifier. The sign man guy is here. He does signs. I should get his card, Selena. He's always got show specials on the air signs. Can't beat that. And he's got a bunch of test equipment here as well, too. I'm not sure what he's got here. Wise. What are these? Looks like some kind of computers and stuff like that. So. More commercial radio gear here. Look at all the good stuff here. Look at all these Motorola's. Guys love their Motorola's. And he's giving mics away. I paid that mic a hundred. I, I bought one of these mics for 150 bucks a day, and he's giving them away with ten. I think. Uh, yeah, I might even do five. I think. I think. Yeah, he might do five. <laughs> More stuff in here. This guy's definitely cleaned out. Uh, well, not the basement. The garage is still full of stuff, but he's getting he's getting through all the stuff here. He's even got some nice camera stuff. You'll find anything at Hamfest, that's for sure. More parts all bagged up here, nice and neat. There we go, a TS700. I had one of those. That's, uh, I think, 10 watts, right? Yeah. 10 watts on sideband, great radio, had a great front end. Uh, on FM, there was uh, no pager in it. The only thing I'm trying to remember, this is the one had uh, tone. No, it does not. Yeah, but most of the time we use this on two meter sideband. Good stuff from Kenwood when Kenwood was was making ham radio stuff More stuff here 7900 great price Motorola speaker signal link. You'll need that for uh, How many ounces? I don't want to say it FT8 uh, 
Okay, here we got a looper up here. We got this looper, and this guy's doing two meter sideband, EBM, VE3 EBM, two meter sideband in the car, mobile. He, uh, I think he's one of those guys that won't work FM, so he'll work two meter sideband in the car. Lots of good stuff here, lots of heat kit stuff. Oh, isn't that what you want? Yeah, He's even got an HW7. How much is the HW7? Five dollars. Oh, oh no, no, no. If you want, you know, at the end of the day, I think if you want to put a well, just a moment. I just gave one five dollars and take a second because it's two of us. Okay. 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 Here they're, they're they're haggling over the door fee, but he already paid. What do you ask him for the HW7? I I would like to get fifty dollars. Fifty dollars for it. Okay. Very good. We got weather radios here. You don't see this thing here, the WWB radio. It is for sale. He said it's for sale. He will sell it. He's even got a sports camera here. Look at that. There you go. Epic camera, sport camera, perfect for field day. Yeah, there's a contemporary phone down there on the floor. Yeah, you might be asking too much for that. I'm afraid to ask for what you want for the contemporary phone, because it's a ham fest, right? I didn't think we could bring. Uh, Wow. You know, it's telephones and stuff. Right? Yeah, exactly. Oh, are you handing me some and we got more stuff here. Icon 5100, new in the box, and an FT70DR new Those in the box. So there you go. Here's our ham fest today. Crowds are starting to come in here. It's going to be a good day for a ham fest. 73s.